hey guys, hey, welcome back to our speed duel deck profile. Hey, take, take, take a look at uh, Invitation to the Society with Kaiju cards. Alright, I feel like uh, that's like the that's like the best way for me to explain this. Uh, uh, that's like the best way for me to explain this deck. Uh, this deck is really weird. I'm trying my best to make uh, to make this skill work, but uh, right. Uh, Make this deck work, but it's really hard. It just sort of this skill in theory sounds really good, but then you real you read White Veil and realize, oh wait, you just die because you're playing White Veil. Because White Veil has the clause where if it leaves the field, you just take three thousand burn. You just take three thousand damage, you know. So uh, you die, you die surely for that reason, right? So um, for that reason, all right. Uh, let's get to the deck. So um, the whole point of this deck is to kaiju your opponent. You give them the Dogare. This thing has three thousand attack. You, you get rid of whatever big monster they have, you summon, you give them a uh, Dolgoran, then you steal it back and you attack with Dolgoran, right? And that's, that's pretty much it. That's what this deck is pretty much what it's about. Uh, next, so like I said, you lose to every single back row card in the game, right? You cannot deal with back row. So, hey, they put Breaker to three. So we're playing triple Breaker for that reason, uh, right? So, yeah, three Breakers. Three breakers just because this guy has this guy is also just a spell room and also a body, so it may or may not come up. He's also a dark, which is really relevant, right? Uh, triple spirit cube. I say, uh, you die real easily, you know. Like the whole point of the deck is to set up this Dolgoran white Velka. You cannot afford to take damage, right? Because as soon as you go to three, go to sub three thousand light points, right? You just lose to anything with this deck because of that, right? Uh, next, since we're playing six. Six, uh, six dark. We have to play double allure. Uh, I really wish Radiant was in this game. If if the dark kaiju was in this game, this deck would be solid. It'd be way more easier to play with. But it's not, so we have to do this. But yeah, that's the, but yeah, that's the main package of the deck. Uh, with, of what you want to do right there. Uh, next, like I said, uh, we're playing a white veil deck. So we're playing triple white veil. Uh, the whole point is you equip it to Dolgoran, you steal it back and you attack, and then it turns the moss into pretty much a strip in Armadies where when it during when it attacks, your opponent can't activate any spell card. So there, there you go. Next we play triple hidden armory. Uh, this is just to get access to the white veil faster. Honestly, that's pretty much it. Like I said, next the whole point of that is to see this, right? That's the whole point of this. Like you just want to see this combo and hope that it sticks, you know, right? Hope that your opponent does not have anything. Next for our limit one, like I said, the limit one is pretty pointless in this deck. Uh, we're playing one Zoma. I just wanted another body, right, in theory. In theory for this deck to have, right, because you don't have a lot of moss. Like I said, the only moss you're really playing is Breaker, if you think about it. So you don't, so I wanted to play Breaker. If you want, you could put this as the MST to deal with more back row cards, right? But yeah, that's completely up to you. I think Zoma, one Zoma is fine. Also, it just threatens your opponent, like, if they attack. Into this with the dog render, they're gonna take 3k from it, right? So they gotta consider that fact, right? And then finally for our last limit three is three Sakura Su armor. Um the limit three in this deck really doesn't matter right enough it, well, in theory, so it doesn't really matter. Uh you definitely do not want to play cosmic cyclone because because you'll die. Like I said, like I said, you you die to a this deck just dies to a lot of things, right? So I don't want to play cosmic cycle just for the fact that if the white veil gets removed from that point, I just straight up die. I straight up lose. So I just rather play three cycle armor. Like I said your limit three is extremely irrelevant. It could be anything. Book, DD Warrior Lady, um, wall of disruption, Saku, like I, it doesn't really matter. Pick whatever limit three you want. You know, I, I don't really care. Right, and then finally for the extra, extra is really is a bunch, bunch of waking the dragon targets when you don't play waking the dragon. So, uh, jumbo drill, stealth, Megazord, Voltron, Dragoon, Siren, Ojama King, Jumbo Drill Roy, and that's all. Like I none of this matter. It's a bunch of waking the dragon targets. You know, make your opponent think you have an extra. Who knows, right? Trick them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit them. You know, right? Uh, make them think. Uh, make them fear awakening when you really just want to summon a giant kaiju. All right. Oh uh, yeah, that's the deck. Uh, I said I try really try try make this a deck based on the skill really, but it's really hard. It turns out, you know, right? Because I found out that you could only attack with monsters equipped with white veil, so that fucking sucks, right? Yeah. Or rather, until you activate white veil. But like I like I said, I don't want to play the arm drag and stuff. I feel like the arm drag is just too slow. It takes up so much space in this deck that you have no way to run it properly. Right, so that's the reason why I'm not playing that. So I just figured, I just, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna steal attack with Dolgren and be, and I hope that's good enough, you know. All right, that's the deck. Thanks for watching. Like always, if there's a deck you guys want to see, comment down below. I'll try to get to it eventually. I got a bunch of these lined up. Thanks for watching. Okay, thanks. Bye.